Oh, just if something exploded. Whoa! Tonight, honoring the hero who was hurt during a series of explosions at Oktoberfest in Huntington Beach. The fireball at Old World Village injured five people, including the owner of that restaurant who cleared the patio just before the explosion. Kick on down, Orange County reporter Stacey Butler has more tonight from Huntington Beach. It's Oktoberfest here at Old World Village, but it's completely shut down. Instead of celebrating, those that gathered here tonight did so to pray. There was a lot of people in there, so he's got a lot of people praying for him. You know, hope he's back soon. Gathering tonight to pray the rosary for Bernie Bischoff. It's just shocking that it happened and just hope nothing but good things for Bernie because, like I said, he's such a sweetheart. The family doesn't deserve to go through anything like this. His attorney allowed our cameras in briefly before the vigil began inside the Old World Banquet Hall in Huntington Beach. Something exploded. Whoa! Two explosions lit up the night sky this weekend when a transformer inside an underground electrical vault exploded at the Old World Village German restaurant. The beloved restaurant owner remains in serious condition tonight with burns over almost 40% of his body. He was running on fire through the restaurant and um, security saw him and he did the drop roll deal with him and got the fire off of him and then was hitting him with the table linen to get the fire off. Today, SoCal Edison crews were on site. A spokesperson there would say only that they are investigating. They're trying to figure out why this 50 pound door on the dining patio that covers the underground vault that contains the three transformers blew off. Whoa. Minutes before it happened Saturday night at 8 o'clock, a server smelled something funny and cleared more than 40 customers from the patio. He called the fire department. Minutes later, Bischoff and fire crews were walking toward the transformer when it blew. Bischoff's sister says two weeks ago they smelled something odd near the vault and called Edison. She says they came out looked at it and said it was okay. This thing had actually already had blown up years ago and they put a brand new transformer in and said this is good to go. You don't have to ever worry about this again. Bischoff's attorney told us that he's expected to recover, but he's going to be in the hospital at least two to four more weeks. He says he plans on holding a press conference Tuesday afternoon. In Huntington Beach, Stacey Butler, KCAL 9 News.